It's estimated that 31 million people are affected by the flu each year. And keeping the flu away is not just about getting the flu vaccine. It's also important to eat healthy and keep your immune system functioning at its very best. But one factor that could work against you when it comes to fighting the flu, your body weight. And a recent study published by the International Journal of Obesity says that obesity is a risk factor for flu complications and might make the vaccine less effective. Dr. Yeah. Jorge. This, this study is actually quite interesting. It looked at approximately 1,200 patients, and it found that people that had a BMI above 40 had almost twice the risk of getting the flu as people that did not. So 10% versus 5%. So when you tell this to people, they think, oh, is it because the flu doesn't get through the fat? I think that's everybody's first idea, and it, and it doesn't. The, the flu vaccine is absorbed no matter what, but as we reiterate all the time, being overweight knocks down almost like all of the hormonal patterns in your body, including something called T cells, which are the main thing that help you actually make antibodies to fight against uh, the flu. So being overweight, and this is a substantial BMI, a BMI which stands for body mass index, uh, which basically is your height divided by your weight or something like that, but if it's over 30, you're overweight. If you're over 40, you are markedly and morbidly obese. So all that contributes not just to your heart health, but to your immune health. And you're much more likely to get infections and you're much less likely to be protected against certain infections like the flu virus. And we know last winter was a really bad flu, you know, and this year it may be more of the same. But I think this was a really interesting point that if your BMI is over 40, they, at least the researchers hypothesized that might be why they're more susceptible to the flu despite the shot, which we're still saying to get, yes. just a little bit more likely to develop the flu and also develop complications. Exactly. Which is one of my pet peeves is people that are overweight, and listen, I, I've struggled with it all my life, that say, oh, I'm overweight, but I'm healthy. That really is not true. There may be nothing obvious at this time but your body is just not functioning as healthily as it could if you were of a normal weight. I mean, you're setting yourself up for orthopedic problems. I mean, are people that have come on who have done the massive weight loss makeovers themselves, I mean, that's they just say, I'm energized and I'm healthy and I'm active and my joints feel great. So all good reasons to find your best weight. Yeah. So yet another good reason. Yeah. To and the side effect of exercising, I always say, is just sexiness. So you'll be healthy and you'll be sexy. Yeah. You're just and winning all around. And hopefully... That may be the best reason. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Thank you for that, doctor.